Yeah, chapter 3, Clement's Point. Okay, we finished chapter 2. A few days later. The green, the greener pastures complete chapter two. It doesn't have a fifty fifty one case I have something this day for X percent. Okay, here is the golden dot. Now, what we are going to do? We are going to the mission for this fellow because we forgot from this fellow. We forgot this fellow, Albert Mason. I think that's the last mission we're going to do in this session. How you feeling? Okay, a little better. Good. How are you? Fine. Hey, do you think... Okay, so let's go to... Albert. Alex, well, whatever his name is. Yeah. It's Albert. Alex Mason is the character from the main protagonist in Black Ops 1. And Black Ops 2. <laughs> so let's go to Albert and. See what he has offered for us. And probably, and maybe this is going to be the last. Maybe Albert's mission is going to be the last mission for this session. Hey! Over here! Over here! Please, friend! You gotta help me out here! Come on, please! I'm about done here. If I don't get these shackles off soon, I'm a goner. Please. This is crazy. Just shoot the shackles! One bullet! That's all! Whoa, hey! Jesus! There you go. Oh, thank God! Oh, what I waited to hear that noise for Okay, there you go, I helped you. Yeah, I got me on the I got kind I, I got some pieces of money. I wish I could give you some money or Well, you know, I might have something of interest. A fellow on the chain line jawed on about this little homestead owned by some lonely drunk. Yeah, it keeps a lot of money stacked away. Dead south of Rhodes, on the river. You sure I'm the right person for this sort of information? Okay, we have home robbery, which I ain't we're going to do finish the mission with Do with Dutch. it what you will. So we are going to finish the mission for Dutch, then we are going to do a home robbery. Yeah. Now let's con let's continue our way to Albert. Okay, we're just uh, gathering from yeah. to just gathering in Albert. Let's see where she is. What he has to offer. Okay, I can see him. Hello there, Albert. So, you're still alive. Uh, Mr. Morgan! How are you? Indigestible, apparently. Aside from that, very well. How's the project going? Well, I'm this getting is God's country, three. and I am his faithful servant. Although perhaps not his most talented one. I have been trying to capture the grace of the wild horses here for weeks. Only muggers can't stand horses. me. Horses. Yeah, isn't there, isn't that, isn't there a song from Rolling Stones called Wild Horses? No. Beautiful. Won't come anywhere near me, of course. He can smell my stupidity. Well, how about I drive him over? Oh, that might help. Can you be bothered? I feel like such a blunderer. Sure. Wait here. At least this time I doubt I'll get eaten. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, boy. All right to the wild yeah. horses. Okay, there's a song from Rolling Stones about cool wild horses. I will put it in. If it's not, then I'm, I want to play.
kind of close to Let's go. Go on. Okay, I have to be a shepherd Stop again. Oi, soy, 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 soy. Taken? Go then! Up, up. Let's make you all famous! He died. He, he, he's not photogenic, so he, so, yeah. he just escaped. You know what await what the what awaits what the wait him. You are a genius. No, but I can ride a horse. Well, in my world, that makes you a genius. You're too kind. <laughs> so how are the uh, photos coming along? Oh, amazing! Here, I have a print of the wolves before they try to eat us. It's for you. That's real fine. Well, thank you. Take care, Mr. Mason. You too, sir. You too. Okay, I can hear a see. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, we have time for one more mission. Let's see where is the mission? What's this? Thanks. Okay, so that's the animation for Dutch. I'm first, first, let's see something. Climb in the camp. We went fast level, to, we went fast level to the camp. There's no fast travel in this game. So, let's, so, we'll meet, so let's see you guys when we reach the lodge. Trying to get these supplies to the federal building. Move it's on, on to me. Boy. We just look at the got no authority here. here. We'll be taking Hey! Boy! Let the you man best go. be going! You're gonna have Lamor and Raiders holding this right.
wager you're a dead man. Yep. I can sell this flag, but actually I won't sell it because I'm with the rigid Dutch. No, I'm having to worry about standing up. Home robbery, Javier. Okay, we have Javier. So we're going to do so we're going to do Dutch, then home robbery, then home robbery, and after that, Mr. Pearson. She's looking at the river, but what the fuck is he doing? Hello! How you doing, old friend? And you're some. <coughs> Fine. It's funny. Us ending up down here. My daddy died in a field in Pennsylvania, fighting this lot. I ever tell you that? Many times. I see I'm boring you, Arthur. Worrying me. We lost men back there. We have lofty goals, Arthur. We're trying to reform society to a kinder, truer, better way. Now, of course, there's gonna be casualties. We're thieves in a world that don't want us no more. We are dreamers in an ever duller world of facts. Now, I'll give you that, but come on. Hello, Dutch. We got the day. It's nice out. Old Jose says that there's a trick around here. I reckon it's full of fish. Show us this crick you've been pissing in. Hey, you don't look too rosy, old friend. I thought this warmer weather would... My days are looking good and long over Dutch. <laughs> Always green crushing and bubble bursting, you. Come on, Jose. Let's go fishing. Right, oh, no, we're going fishing. how it's done. So how we started this session, we're finishing this session. It's boring. The most boring activity in the world, fishing. Why don't we just fish here? There's a whole lake of them. Because I need to get out for a bit. Me and the old guard. Before any of them back there, oh, there was us. The curious couple and their unruly son. It feels good here. You did well finding that spot, Arthur. More Charles than me. It's like I can breathe again, thick and soupy as this air is. Might even do your whistling pipes some good, Jose. <laughs> I was once in this country with Bessie. Ah, feels like a lifetime ago. It was a lifetime ago. But what a life we have lived, how well we have fought, especially both of you. I hope so. But now, when things are desperate, we have to stick with the plan. 
Make enough money, then find somewhere where nobody will find us. Where we don't have to hide. Uh, like where? I got some ideas hatching, but I need you with me, not against me. Okay, no, I'm going Both against of you. Of course. Still, we do need money. So keep a low profile, especially in the local town. After Valentine, I want everyone on best behavior here. No trouble. But start turning over the soil and the rocks. See what turns up. Guys, the gang That's episode of We've got to be discreet. Okay. Imagine what a slew of rich, simple tins there must be down here. Oh, ho, ho. this is perfect. Yes, we are. Hosea. We are receiving the tins. Play them like fire. a fiddle. 20... Nothing would give me greater pleasure, but no buts. Not today. Weapons. And we call weapons. And we enjoy the day. Looks like law up ahead. Play it cool. Drug in. Well, well, look who it is. To bother. Quiet back there. Let's see if we can't sort this out. <laughs> we can help you, How guys. are you, boys? Fine. This is quite some country you have here. We like it well enough. Hoagie McIntosh, at your service. Lee Gray. This is my deputy, Archibald McGregor. It's good to meet you. You a Scott? Partly. The best part. <laughs> of course. <laughs> now, tell me, sir, what did the silly, fancy fop back there do? Nothing too terrible, I trust. He was accused of running a gold mining investment scam. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm sure he wasn't. Okay, they're going he is to, a magician. They're going to I escape. know him. He's a fool. But he is not a bad fellow. Now, can we... Can we just... Uh... I wouldn't do that if I were you! I... Shit! I... The Anderson boys! I can't have more scandal! Well, allow us to help, my friend. Arthur! Chase wanted man. Uh, and, and take Archibald with you. Just what I signed up for. Come on, big guy! Come on, come on, come on, come on. Discuss the foolish magician. Stay with that train! Don't let them get away! And do not shoot them, you hear me? Come on, hurry! All right, come on, we're losing okay, I'm doing my best. Will you relax, we're not losing them. Faster, come on. What's your name, sir? Arthur. Arthur Callahan. Faster, yeah, Mr. To... Callahan, please. Yeah, my neck is on the line here. I yeah, I'm doing my things. bad. So what are these fellas wanted for? Looks like the son of a bitch is going to make... Change the you sure can't just shoot the him. Him. No, did I not say that? You said plenty. Yeah. God, so, except Chase, so when, 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 when they say Chase, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Now get after the others. Come on. The train is slowing down to go through the station. Now's our chance. See if you the, can get alongside the train. Uh, we're not we're not you need to get alongside it. We're not starting the games. Get alongside that flat carriage. You think you can jump on there? Me? Why me? Because you ride like my grandmother. You are something else. Whoa! You cock bastards! They didn't do nothing! They didn't do nothing! Oh. God! Damn you! Let go! Run! Don't let them get away! They're only making it Okay, okay. Bastard. Have Damn bastard. Get the hell away from me. I'm gonna ride ahead and stop the train. 
Okay, here one. It's just us then, law man. Come here. Do we need to bother? Let me go. Can't do that. Try at least. Just don't kill him. Are you sure? Sadly, sir. I'm right after you need to. Need some gin? Come on. Who's talking now? Huh? Is everything all right in there? Well, yes. I don't think he's dead. I think I won the fight. Oh, just about. Pick up the Anderson boy. Okay. He suddenly the cowboy starts working with here. the law. Deputy? Sounded like quite a commotion. Is that him? I sincerely hope so. Old Anders Anderson. So what now? Take him in. Come on. A fine job. Well done. And a pat on the back for me for stopping the train. There you go. You are a natural. All right, let's take him in. Follow me. What about the following? Elf? Oh, we'll round him up. Anders back there is the brains of the operation, and that's really saying something. You're the boss. That was mighty impressive, sir. I have to admit. I'd hazard a guess you've served the law yourself at some point. Well, I wouldn't exactly say that. Are you familiar with the area here? No, not really. On your right here, these tobacco fields? This is part of Caliga Hall, big estate belonging to the Gray family. Looks bone dry. Yes, we are in dire need of some rain round here, let me tell you. The Greys have lived in Caliga Hall for generations. Fine people. My family's been working for them for years. Sheriff Gray's the one I know best, of course, but they own half the businesses in town. Which town? So the Gray Road, family. Sir. You don't know it? Where we're headed right now. Okay, so the Gray families are the one responsible for everything that has happened in the road. What it was before the war, but it has its charms. Yeah, I'm sure family. you already know of the Braithwaites. Like I said, just got down here. Another big family in these parts. They have an estate west of here. Awful people, truly awful. They've been fighting with the Greys for as long as I can remember. Sounds like quite the place you got here. We're gonna bear left here. You definitely have to start constructing roads. Yeah, you already showed me that. Okay, looks like it uh, looks like that in chapter three we are restricted of any weapons. It's kind of okay. Here we are. It, cha it, it, ch it changed the road. It changed the road. Up there the on your left is the Rhodes Parlor House. Very reputable saloon owned by the Gray family. We also have a general store, gunsmith, post office, train station, of course. What more do you need? Very little. Oh, good. They're back. And that's your friend, right? Yep. Okay. We're going to stop just ahead on the right outside the sheriff's office. Can you grab Anders off your horse and carry him in for me? You move under, uh, under, under. Side. Sooner you get him off your horse, sooner we can get him fuck. in the cell. Okay, Where the fuck is Godfather? Under, under, really? We got him. Very good. I told you Arthur would deliver. Man has a passion for justice. That's wonderful. So, uh, about my friend here. Your idiot friend is free to go. But no more trouble from you, partner. I promise you, this was all just a big misunderstanding. However, I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Now, I'll pretend to appreciate that. Mr. McIntosh, it has been a real pleasure. The mostly good citizens of Rhodes, we welcome you. Well, we're just honored well, to be so here. To make your friend one behave. First, one, one of the first we got enough trouble from some of the Dutch residents. McIntosh. Old who've gone sadly to seed and lost their dignity. How terrible. Come along now. I will keep this fellow on the maybe straight end maybe, 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 maybe it was Come back and see us sometime soon. Excuse me, jobs. gentlemen. Now, Bo, these better be ugly rumors. 
Is it true you were seen talking to that wretched Penelope Bracewaite? I can't thank you enough. Where have you been? Around. And where are you staying? I'm renting. A caravan on the edge of town behind the church. It's horrible, but no one comes looking. The whole town is trapped in this interminable feud between the two families. His lot, Grays, and the Braithwaites. Interesting. Two old plantation houses and falling out of rebel gold and marrying cousins or not marrying... Arthur, That's Jose, you start poking around. See what you can find out about that. I have missed you, boys. I've heard about bounty. Well, there's been a price on my head for 13 years. It'll take a month to find us down here, and it seems like we can have a little sport. Well, they're good bounties. Where you hear this? Some fellas I met at a camp near the state line said there was talk of it in bars in the north and west for 500 miles. There was talk of super agents or some such. Super agents? <laughs> I'd love to meet one. It's just talk. I'm sure it is, but I could not tell you. Stay out of trouble. Thank you, gentlemen. Hm. Okay, see, I... Looks like that's it. Okay, so these two plantation families. Arthur, you start sniffing around the Gray's place, see what the story is there. Yeah, I passed by it earlier with our friend, Archibald. Good. Hosea. You see what you can find out about these Braithwaites. All right. Thank you, Arthur. Quite a fishing trip. There's still time. I'm up for it. How about you, Arthur? Have you had enough of the chase for one day? No, if you're playing uh, fishing. I'll need to relax someplace. Fair enough. It looks like it's you and me, old man. You have to go fishing. I don't. I, I'm not. I'm not the kind of a fishing guy. I don't want to, to, to start. I don't want to finish the session with the same activity that they started the session. Okay. Should not play the new sound. Listen, I have a mission for. Morning. Sachu do do we have a mission for you? Home robbery. Mr. Person and home robbery for Sean. Then we are going to do Lapor Strauss and. Who are you, Mr. Grace? Okay, but do we have a bounty here? Looks like we don't. Hello kids, this is it for now, see you guys next session, until then, I'm going to change uh, appearance and everything, until then, bye bye.